Hi, in this tube, we're going to look at how the slideshow templates in PowerDirector can be used and customised. Of course, using the templates isn't compulsory. Slideshows can also be built manually. Many of the templates can be customised within PD. Cell, Highlight, 3D, Motion and Camera all have user controls. We're going to check these out. Some templates can't be customised. What you see is what you get. With no customisation used, PD's slideshow templates look like this. Cell inserts photos in different arrangements in a fairly quick moving presentation. Highlight places images over grayscale versions of the same photo. Collage and scrapbook are similar, with images being dropped onto a grayscale background. Montage is similar again, but over a moving background. Motion slideshows give a full screen display and can add an extra dimension to your images. 3D places photos in floating frames over a gold background. Another one of our toots shows how to change the frames and backgrounds if golden glitz isn't what you want. The normal template just applies a variety of transitions to a set of pictures. The camera slideshow template is new to PD9. The background shifts through a larger image with foreground images in photo frames. If frilly frames aren't your thing, these can be modified using other software. In PD, once a template is selected, it can be customised in many ways after PD has done its initial mix. Of course, if you like what PD does, then just click OK. In Cell, photos can be shifted from one slide to another by dropping them in the unused photo panel. From one cell to another, just by dragging and dropping. Extra images can be brought in to replace ones in the slideshow. The number of photos on each slide can be changed and the whole slideshow remixed. The focus area of each image can be adjusted too. With the 3D template, only the focus area can be reset. In Highlight, both the foreground and background images can be recropped. With 
with the motion template, individual motion paths can be modified. In camera view, images can be moved around just as in the cell template. The camera and 3D templates have backgrounds and frames that can be modified, but the graphics need to be made in other software. If you want to add your own style, we have instructions available for doing this, and even sets of frames and backgrounds for download. In these examples, you can see how the overall impact can be changed. Once you've produced a slideshow, or a series of different ones, there are lots of possibilities for using them in a video production. A slideshow looks great on its own, especially if there's some variety in format. It can be inserted over a video clip to show a different view. Still shots can be used to break up lengthy video segments. Here, a number of slideshows using the same images are displayed at once. Produced slideshow can have the whole range of PD's effects applied. Here, the TV wall effect is used with a cell slideshow. This can work really well as part of a music video. The possibilities are only limited by your imagination. That's about it for now. Thanks for watching. Don't be afraid to hit the subscribe button. We love new subscribers.